We are here with me. With me. Top five with me. All right, sorry I had to do that again, but you know him. This is Jason Park. You can call him JP. You can call him Jason. You can call him uh, Emmett. I really don't care what you call him, but you can call me tonight. <laughs> Okay, last time, I swear, but we're really gonna do it. Uh, top five, are you ready to do this? I'm ready. Knuckle my, punch? My body is ready. Uh, top five animals. I do this with a few people, and I definitely have to do it with you. Mm -hmm. Cats, first of all, all-time favorite. Cutest, although sometimes weird personalities. If you have a cat with the best personality, that's like top tier pet ever. Yeah. Uh, same place, puppies are cool, I guess. They have better personalities. They're slightly less cute, but they have overall better personalities, I guess, sometimes. Sometimes they're potential. They, yeah, sometimes they suck. Bunnies, which are the opposite end. I think bunnies are actually one of the cutest animals out there, but just their personalities are usually a little boring. Some bunnies are really they're, cool. They're kind of like but, a blank piece of paper. Yeah. That will never have anything drawn on it. But it's they're just so adorable. <laughs> and then uh, I really like ferrets. They're really cute. And fifth, I'm gonna go with guinea pigs. I Ooh. love guinea pigs. They're That's a good super, one. They're really cute little they're guys. The hamster plus. Yeah, <laughs> hamster plus. <laughs> Instead of doing top five tricks, we're gonna do top five most difficult tricks. Top five most difficult that have been done that I can do, or yeah, just, just in, in general. Opinion. In your opinion. Okay. <laughs> top five most difficult tricks. That's a good one. Say one will be uh, front side heel flips. Surprisingly hard front heels. Super tough. I don't know why. Just for like how easy they should be. For some reason, they're really tough. They're easier to switch. Yeah, they Way are. Easier. They're either much easier to switch. I agree. For me personally, switch back 180s. I don't know why. Uh, it's easier if you do switch back heel. I feel like. I agree. But just switch back 180s. Can't do them. Terrible at them. Front threes, regular. Somehow, I don't understand. How, I mean, without tic tacking. Absolutely. With, e again, easier switch for me. Yeah, exactly. Easier switch and front threes without tic tacking. Insanely hard. That was three, right? Yeah. Uh, Tail grabs, ollie tail grabs, really hard trick for some reason. Pop shove tail grabs, totally doable. Ollie tail grabs, super hard for some reason. I'm gonna have to try that. Yeah, they're like way harder than they should be. Dude, truck stands. Truck oh. stands are so hard. It's like a Casper, except in say your oh, back one on no, the tail, yeah, yeah, it's on yeah. the truck. Yeah. Truck stands, super hard trick. All right, that's good. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's gonna be Googling that, like, well, what is that? Yeah, truck stands are hard. All right, and then on opposite, uh, the best tricks ever done by anybody. Best tricks ever done by anyone. Oh, that's good. I like that. The Tony Hawk could have done it. Okay. Uh, Jamie Ellington. Jamie uh, Ellington. Jeff, Jeff Sorry. I really love 360 hard flips, and my favorite one was Jimmy Carlin. In a, oh, I know you're It was like an Osiris tour video. Yeah, Jimmy Carlin, three hard, done like a double set. That was like the best one ever done, in my opinion. Uh, John Mata. Happy medium one, Vero heel wall ride down like a six stair on like a total vertical wall, just straight vertical wall. Vero heel back wall ride, perfect. Did it perfect. John Rob, John Rob Moore, and Nolly hippy jump. Ooh. Happy medium three. Look that up. That's dev. You got it. Look that up. Look, Look all of Happy Medium up, but definitely watch that. Yeah, it's the last trick in his part. It's like a bike rack, and he does a nolly, no flip, just nolly. Hippy jump and the board just rises up to the top. It's barely <laughs> wide enough to like for his board to go through. It was like real skinny and he did it. Go Miyagi and uh, video Any, nasty. Anything he does? Yeah, he did this trick where he goes, I mean anything he does really, but he goes in the grass, gets on his back like roly poly, and then like spins, like roll, does a barrel roll with his body while keeping his board off the ground and on his feet while he's like lying down. It's like the craziest thing. I don't know how he did it. Most of the stuff that he does, it's like, it's really hard to explain. Yeah, you can't, you just gotta watch it. Go Miyagi, it's like G-O-U, uh, video, it looks like it's spelled goo, uh, video nasty. Unamas. Um, I'm gonna go with oh, uh, Danny Gonzalez. There's a ditch where it's like wall, like bank, wall, bridge, and he does a wall oh, ride. Danny Gonzalez, on, yes. On the roof of it's the like bridge. Upside down wall. Upside ride. down wall, roof ride. Melon grabs out, pulls out. I think it was melon. Oh, that's, that roof was ride. Yeah. Danny Gonzalez. Inverted ride your skateboard. Roof ride. That is, those are my picks. Top five candy. Oh, uh, nerds rope. I love Nerds Row. You were so ready yeah. to answer this, dude. Uh, sour watermelon. Li Hing sour candy is from like Hawaii. Like Li Hing, it's like this weird plum powder thing. Yeah, I don't they're know. They're tasty. Uh, they add it to like sour watermelon and stuff. It's like the most delicious. The sour thing watermelon ever. is the best. Yeah, it's just incredible. What else is a good candy? I like Butterfingers. Not as much now as I used to because it just gets stuck in my it's teeth a, now. As far as chocolate goes, that's a solid choice. Yeah. I'm the same way. Like when I was younger, I was way more into candy bars. Now it just gets stuck in my teeth. And yeah, candy bars in general, not as much into, but Butterfinger for sure. Oh, what's a White Rabbit. 
Wait, do you know what white rabbit is? No, I mean, I know what a white rabbit is. That's oh. a candy? <laughs> yeah, it's, I guess it's an Asian candy. It's like, it's got a little white rabbit. It's like a milk, a milky milk candy. It's I'm like gonna delicious. Get, get some white rabbit, yeah. Andy. I'll try it. White man, white rabbit. Top five places on earth. Easily first place that I've ever been to, Hawaii. Kalo by hey. far. Kaneohe! But definitely Hawaii, like, by far. I've been to some crazy places. I went to Europe for the first time this year. It was amazing, but... Nowhere will compare to Hawaii. You can go to the beach in like December, amazing. January. Yeah, and we're going. Which to. we are yeah. going to the beach yeah, in January. So <laughs> second place. I like Arizona a lot, and mainly I, as a place, like it's like whatever. Like if I didn't skate, I would never name it. But for skateboarding, Arizona has some of the coolest, craziest spots I've ever skated. And good so. people. Awesome people, crazy people. Yeah. Arizona, like the sun fries their brains, but it makes them way more interesting and cool. Like some of my best friends are from Arizona. They're like the best humans ever. I really liked when I went to Hungary, Budapest specifically, uh, recently this year. That was awesome, had a great time there. Uh, when I was in Europe also, uh, Strasbourg was really cool. Um, and finish it off, you know, I haven't been there since 2007, but I went to Colorado. I liked it a lot. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. I've never been there, but I've heard like good things about Colorado. Yeah, I've only been there once, so it's hard to say, but I, I remember loving it. The memory lot. of Colorado is definitely on the list. We'll go with that. Top five activities to do besides skateboarding. No. Is there anything else besides skateboarding? Um, video games? Yes. Specifically Super Smash Bros. Um, music? Does that count? Oh, Listening yeah, sure. to slash. Playing. Enjoying, appreciating. Just music in general and eating, eating, Dude, totally, eating, yes. binge eating. Yes, I would, I would just die without it. Yeah, late <laughs> hiking is cool. Yeah, hiking in Hawaii. I mean, anywhere really, but in Hawaii, it's, it's like really a, good there. It's super, super fun. Hiking is awesome. And for my fifth choice. I'll say watching skate videos. Oh no, that's totally one, dude. Yeah, that watching skate one. videos. Because it's different than actually skating. Because I'm obsessed with skating and it's like the only thing in my life and without it, I'd be a useless pile of meat contributing yep. nothing to society. Um, You'd be dying. the crazy guy at the skate park sitting on the bleachers not skateboarding. Yeah, that'd be me. All right, well to wrap it up, do you want to go over and do one trick? Yeah, All right. what, what trick do you want? I, I do not care at all. Uh, how about you do an ollie? Okay. Suppose we're just gonna do a trick on here. This is first try. Do it, dude! Oh! Whoa! Dude, that was sick! <laughs> that was weird! It's raining, go! Alright, thank you for doing this, my friend. Uh, my friend. At Jason Park Sucks on Instagram. Follow him, you'll like what you see, uh, and uh, get behind this human being, he's awesome. You're gonna see some weird stuff on Instagram. It's gonna it's, push yeah, it's the boundaries of what's acceptable on the internet. You're gonna wish you were dead. I want to wish I'm dead? Doug! You're not Jason, but do you want to do a bonus clip? Yeah, sure. Doug, rolling up switch. Success. We're out of here. Jason!